We need to work this off of your frequency. Ours is tied up. The Government Emergency Telecommunications Service, GETS, and Wireless Priority Service, WPS, provide first responders, government officials, and other disaster response and recovery personnel with priority calling during times of network congestion. Today I'm going to share some tips on how to program your smartphone for easy dialing of both GETS and WPS calls. When making a GETS call, you may need to enter up to 32 digits, which can take time and also lead to dialing errors, especially in an emergency situation when you're rushed. Here are some tips to make that process quicker and easier using the wait feature on your cell phone. There are two ways to do this. The first is to create a standalone GETS entry in your contact list. The second option is to add your GETS card information to existing contacts that you would call during an emergency. Both options will also work when making a combined GETS WPS call. To add a standalone GETS entry using the wait feature, first, create a new contact named GETS call for the phone number. Enter any of the GETS access numbers which are located on the GETS card. Next, you'll add a wait to the phone number. To do this on BlackBerry phones, press B on the keyboard or press and select add wait. A black W icon will be inserted into the entry. For iOS phones, press the plus star hashtag key and then press the wait key. A semicolon will be inserted into the entry. On an Android phone, press the sim key or the wait key. A semicolon will be inserted into the entry. Then type in your GETS PIN. If you have WPS and want to add the WPS feature, create a WPS plus GETS call contact and type star 272 before the GETS access number. This method allows you to skip the process of dialing the GETS access number and PIN number every time you make a call. But you'll still need to know the destination phone number once you're connected to the GETS carrier and manually type in that number. The next option allows you to skip that and automate the entire dialing process. To add GETS and or WPS dialing information to an existing contact, first select the appropriate contact to add the GETS or combined WPS and GETS number. Then add a new phone number entry for the existing contact. Begin by typing in any of the GETS access numbers located on the GETS card. If you want to add the WPS and GETS options, type star 272 before the GETS access number. Then, you'll add a wait to the phone number, just like we did for the standalone GETS contact entry. For the iPhone, press the plus star hashtag key and then press the wait key. For BlackBerry or Android phones, use the same steps for the wait feature I covered earlier. Then, type in your GETS PIN. You'll then add a second wait to your contact following the same steps as before. Lastly, you'll type in the contact's destination number. When you need to make GETS or GETS and WPS calls to these contacts, the GETS and WPS data are already entered for you. With both scenarios, you may be prompted by your phone after each wait period in order to transmit the GETS PIN and or destination number. These screenshots provide examples of the wait prompts you may see. In each case, simply push the dial, send, or yes button, and your phone will automatically transmit the PIN or destination number, saving you a lot of time and hassle. You should make periodic GETS and WPS practice calls from your phone to refresh your memory and to ensure the numbers are still working properly. To do this, you can use the GETS WPS familiarization line and a phone number you may dial in an emergency as the destination number.